I'm, I, I'm living in uh, Los Angeles now, and uh, I take this walk up a, up a hill. Um, I try to do it as much as I possibly can, um, but it's a beautiful hike once you get up to the top of the hill. Uh, I stopped doing trails because the last trail I went on, we saw a little baby rattlesnake and it scared the living shit out of me. This road's dope because uh, I get to see a nice little view of uh, downtown uh, Glendale. And then right over here, if you see that little white thing up there, that little white thing is the Griffith Observatory in, in Terminator and uh, Paul Abdul's, is it Hush Hush or Rush Rush? Um, but uh, anyway, the reason why I'm putting out this video is because I wanted to talk to you guys. Uh, about six or seven months ago, uh, I quit smoking weed. Uh, I've been a, a, a weed smoker <laughs> since I was a little turd, and I've uh, been a daily weed smoker for, you know, I, forever. Um, and really, I always felt like I never really had a problem with it. Uh, you know, I know people that have problems with weed, where it's like a thing where they have to smoke weed. And it, I never really felt that I had to smoke weed. Um, I could go days and days on end without smoking weed and didn't really give a shit. The reasons why I quit smoking weed is because I've always kind of battled with anxiety and I was finding that when I would get really fucking stoned and I would take like a big fat bong load, um, I would find that my anxiety would just start kicking hard. Like right away, it was like a thing where it was just like, oh shit, here it comes. And then I'd hit a crazy wave of anxiety. So that was really the reason why I quit smoking weed. Now I know a lot of people say like, oh, weed helps anxiety and blah, 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 and this and that, which I, I guess maybe it does, or certain strains do. Uh, for me, that was not the case. Uh, living in Northern California, you're around every single kind of strain of weed. And you know, this house right here, I would love to fucking buy it if I had the money and uh, make something of it, because I love this neighborhood. Look at this fucking thing. It's like totally beat to hell. Looks like somebody abandoned it a long time ago. Yeah, I, I quit smoking weed and I, my anxiety, I, I do believe my anxiety has got better since I quit smoking weed. And um, I was trying to think, you know, oh, maybe there's gonna be all these like other positives, like other, other things that like are great uh, about not smoking weed. And um, you know, off the top of my head, I do notice that I'm not so much, <laughs> this is so funny because you would think like, you know, everybody's like, oh man, smoke weed and you fucking chill the fuck out and blah, blah, blah. I, I find that I'm not so <laughs> on edge that I'm not smoking weed. My anxiety is better not smoking weed. And it's really weird. It's fucking so strange that like the, the things that everybody's like, oh, this helps me. Uh, no. Nah. One thing I was hoping was is that I was hoping that my appetite wouldn't be so ravenous. Well, that's not the case. <laughs> I feel like when I quit smoking weed, all oh, these flowers are really pretty. Oh, cool. Yeah, I figured my appetite would be uh, a little more chill. Uh, no, no, I'm still a uh, uh, hungry, hungry as fuck. Well. And look at this shirt. I'm wearing this shirt about go green, uh, but. <laughs> I don't even smoke it anymore. I kept thinking, oh man, I'm gonna go back to it. Uh, I'm gonna start smoking weed again. Um, but I think if I do go back to smoking weed, I'm not really gonna go back to smoking weed like I did. Uh, I was smoking, you know, from when I woke up to when I fell asleep, just all the time. And it's funny, because now when I go back and I look at old videos, I can tell how baked I am, how slow, how much slower I am in the videos. And like, I would find that like when I would do the videos, I would try to get as stoned as I possibly could just because I thought it was funny like to see how baked I was actually in these videos. I don't know, like smoking weed for me just really never was uh, as much of it, like I was doing it constantly and habitually. It never really, I just didn't really feel like I was ever like super addicted to it or it never really ran my life, you know? Cigarettes, cigarettes ran my existence. Uh, back when I was a kid, I was a heavy smoker for probably 10 years and that shit like I, I, I would I, I would fuck man cigarettes were a, a bad thing for me. I I was always Whorfing those fuckers down. I'd always say like there was never enough cigarettes to you know to, to quench my thirst for smokes But anyway, yeah, like that was a harder one You know, I'm, I'm glad that I did it and I don't think I'm gonna go back to it um, And if I do it'll probably be just a, it'll be a different approach and I won't be smoking that much. Yeah, very strange 
thought the effects were going to be much different. That's another reason why I like this walk so much is because like you got the forest lawn. I think this is forest lawn uh, cemetery that's uh, over here as well. So it's really cool. You get to see a lot of shit in one walk. Um, and then like right down the way you get like a nice view of like downtown LA as well. So I wanted to ask you, the viewer, you at home, uh, did, do you guys smoke weed? Um, <laughs> I know it sounds like a weird question and some of you guys aren't even going to answer. Uh, but it doesn't matter. I just was wondering because I want to know what you guys think. Um, I personally think that weed is such a mild drug and that um, it really doesn't, I don't know, it's like, does it affect certain people? Yeah, it does. Does it affect certain people negatively? Sure. Did it affect me negatively? You know, on one hand, I would say it did uh, with my anxiety and whatnot. But on the other hand, I really never had too much of a hard time with it. And what I would find is that nobody really ever knew I was stoned, ever. Like, they never thought like, oh, Ross is really baked right now. So I, I guess it's like a person-to-person -person thing. I, it's weird. It's like this is the first time in my entire life I've been like super uh, straight, I guess you would say. I don't. I never really was a drinker. Um, and yeah, it's been like I think seven months since I smoked weed. But yeah, I just really don't think uh, much of it at all. Uh, other than I'm glad that I stopped. Um, and when I do go back to it, if ever, uh, it'll definitely be on a much smaller. But I wanted to have this real talk with you guys. Uh, smoking weed is something that I've never really mentioned uh, in any of my videos. I mean, maybe here and there you might have like caught glimpses of me smoking weed somewhere or whatever. Uh, but um, yeah, it's legal in California now. So for you guys that smoke weed, congratulations, I guess. Um, for the kids that are out there that smoke weed, um, watch out because I do cut some cops hair and they were very excited about it being illegal, or illegal now because now they're gonna fuck with kids hardcore, which is the, the shitty side of the legalization of weed. Um, but yeah, and also, what do you guys think about LA? You guys like it here? You hate LA? Everybody's got some weird opinion, especially Californians. You either love LA or you hate LA. I personally think it's the fucking best place on earth. Regardless of the traffic, whatever, you just gotta make sure you get around at certain times. All right, if you enjoyed this video, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. If you didn't enjoy it, go fuck yourself. And uh, yeah, I will be doing more videos Wednesdays and Fridays. Uh, I always got something coming up. Normally, it's not gonna be something like this. I just wanted to have a, a little one-on-one -on -one talk and I've been planning on doing a video like this. All right, guys, uh, fucking, or all right, viewer. See ya, see you next time. Smoke weed every day.